I think one of my most favorite dogs from Anthony was Carl. Grand Champion, Barksdale, Loch Laren, Good Times. Here again, I bought him from Nancy. Um, she had she had Anthony back probably about half the time, mm -hmm. and which is one of the reasons why I think he became such a prolific stud dog mm -hmm. because he was available in North Carolina. Mm -hmm. But if he'd been out here in Oregon, it wouldn't have happened so much. And uh, Carl, of course, produced our becoming Jane, who was winner's bitch and. Under how good came. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was, That's that a was so one. exciting because I, I had showed under Helga a couple times before, and I thought, I mean, she she was such a wonderful judge, mm. but she she demanded perfection in hips, you know. And I, I thought, oh, to show under her would be my dream. Mm -hmm. And um, but at the same time makes you nervous. But yeah. Oh, oh my gosh! I said there's no way that I'd ever have a dog that would be up to her standards. Anyway, but uh, Nancy McDonald happened to break her arm. Oh, that's right. <laughs> and she called me. Um, actually, she had Anthony back there, and, and I'd forgotten about this phone call. She called me and she said, "Barb," she said, "I've got some horrible news." And, you know, what immediately I thought about was Anthony. And she said, and, and she Not told her, me right, 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 right away, and she said, you know, I promised to show these dogs at the CCLA for you and, and all, everything. And I thought, oh, God, he died. I know he died. <laughs> and then she said, but I broke my arm. And I said, oh, thank God. <laughs> I did. <laughs> I was so relieved. I was so relieved. It's only you. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, but um, um, so uh, Lori Jeff, she said, she said, call, call Lori Jeff Greer. Maybe she would show. And I, I did not know Lori Jeff Greer at all. And uh, other than that, she didn't smile a lot. And I, I thought, oh, this. Really, and, and so I called her, and she said I, I would be glad to show her. And I, um, I remember taking her and showing her um, Jessie. We called her Jessie at the national the day before Winter's Pitch was born, or two days, and she looked at her and didn't say. Just kind of looked at her and had, had me move her up and down, and I did. And she said, you know. She might take one of bitch. <laughs> I mean, I was just absolutely floored. She loved her. And the rest is history. And, and I'll, I'll never forget how she met Jessie. Um, Jessie didn't know her from Adam, and she was a little bit of my dog. But she went up to her very slowly and just knelt down, didn't say anything, and just put her hand out and started just talking softly. And Jessie came up and just almost fell in her lap. And those two were, they, they, they didn't know each other at all. And they were such a pair at the National. Jessie wouldn't take her eyes away. Yeah, they were so excited. Yeah, yeah. And I, that was just amazing. Laura Jeff just has this wonderful way of, mm -hmm. Thank you.